hi everyone and welcome back so now we need to start development on the airbnb clone application i'm parallelly also building udemy clone application and the architecture of both the application looks like similar so first we need to build a first we need to do a monorepo setup which contains all your next js application nest js application your apis your proxy gateway and all those things so in most of my projects i'm using pnpm workspace and uh, so I'm using Monorepo with the PNPM workspace and then I'm adding applications and packages. So here, once the Monorepo is ready, we will add a Nest JS APIs and there we can use a Prisma for the, the ORM, like we have a type ORM Prisma and other. And we are going to use Auth0 for authentication. And uh, if you wanted to use a Next JS, then there is a Next Auth authentication library that can that can use your auth0 uh, authentication mechanism i mean you don't need to explicitly use auth0 libraries to use auth you can use a next auth and we will do the integration of uh, next auth with auth0 auth0 is actually a provider and next auth is just a library which will help you to manage the session between your next uh, next js uh, client and server components okay so i will just create a structure like uh, what is our target we are building something uh, with the next js we are using auth0 for the user management so you need to just register a user and because yeah, we are using uh, this auth0 to manage the users and we are using next auth next auth is just interfacing library that will allow you to create a session between next js and your uh, auth0 so auth0 will uh, give you the login when when you enter the username password it will check the session is it will check the validity and then it will create a session for you because your auth0 will be giving us the access token so this is what we are going to do uh, here this is a next js application is going to talk to your auth0 so how it is going to work is it is simple here uh, we will be using next auth and uh, we will just configure one application in the auth0 that application we will provide application details we will provide to the next auth like uh, i think the client id and a secret key and uh, the, the issuer and all there are three four parameters and then you can just do a login when you do the login it will present you the auth0 screen and once you log in with the social provider or a username password it will establish a session for you and it will also maintain the session token in the next auth session i mean whatever the access token it is returning we can maintain that inside a next auth session and that same token can be used to call the api rounds because we also have external api is written in the nest js and nest js will also use the authentic authorization mechanism with the auth0 so we are going to talk to these nest js apis through the next js apis so i'm just using nest and next okay we are writing external services in the nest nest js and uh, from the next js client components we will trigger an api call to the next js and from there if the session exists from the section we session we can extract the id token or access token that access token we can pass as authorization header to the nest js apis i mean we need to have an authentication token or access token authorization or something which we can pass to these nest js services and these services will validate this token against auth0 okay that this token valid uh, has uh, does has not expired all those things and these independent nest js services can use your postgres database prisma orm to read and write the data so this is pretty much the architecture we are using for some of the services like uh, airbnb udemy clone all these services are going to use the same so what we are doing we are first we are going to set up one repo define the basic architecture how we are going to use the authentication and authorization how we are going to manage the session with the auth0 and the next auth we are going to create a next js application in the monorepo we will create a next js and then next js application and the next js ssr will use a next auth in the next auth api routes we will configure uh, our details about the applications right 
so this is how we are going to create so we will create one auth0 application also i mean in auth0 dashboard we are going to create one application uh, okay saying that these are the callback url this is my application id or uh, secret and those secrets we are going to configure with the next auth in the next js okay these are like four or five steps and then you start the next uh, js application when you do the login uh, login with the auth0 right that, that is a provider then it will take you to the login screen and then you will start so this is pretty much we are going to do in the coming videos uh, stay tuned and uh, let's build a airbnb clone